it's been great. It's been great. It's always a pleasure to come back. So it's um, it's been fun. I haven't had a chance to see as many films, but I've been running around doing meetings and uh, going for dinners with Danny DeVito. So there's worse things in life. Well, I think the greatest thing about a film festival is that it's you've got a voice helping an audience to find films that they may never get a chance to stumble across because downloading is great and you know all these other sites love film or all, all these sorts of sites are wonderful but it's just how you make a decision and if you can find somebody to help you lead you into a film you might never make a choice on that's that's a great thing because that will then help you make that next one and then you'll discover something or some and actually also being in an environment where people are chatting and saying well did you see that one and you heard about this one and looking at the audience figures I think it's a great it's a great way of discovery which is what these festivals are all about The, the, the development process is, is indeed quite similar to a film process at the beginning. We always work, uh, we always start a, a game project with a script. Uh, in our case it's, it's a pretty long script because it's an interactive story. Um, so when in a movie you have 150 or 200 pages of script, we have 2,000 pages of script. Um, we then go on to design the entire environment. So those are sketches, illustrations, um, and then we start building the world in 3D. So there's a, there's a first difference here, especially if you do uh, um, a feature film, you don't necessarily build everything in, 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 in 3D. Um, the big difference is going to be when you start creating the interactive part. What you don't do in movies is you don't, most of the time, reinvent uh, the technology that you're going to use to film. Uh, the picture. So, and in, in our case, it's very different. We do reinvent each time uh, the um, uh, uh, the camera. We do reinvent each time, even uh, the uh, projector. We, in in that sense. So, and that's very different from from filmmaking. back um, just around Christmas, so to be back promoting film and in my hometown, it's, um, it's fantastic. I'm really ha happy to be here for the Dublin International Film Festival. The characters potentially, and I think that's, this is up, up for the audience to decide, there's a bipolar element to her, um, which is so fun to play with, especially as an actress. It was Mary Harron gave me a dream, a dream role. Um, so she's really wonderful and really um, intense and I think um, introvert. So playing these things that are not necessarily anything like myself at all <laughs> um, was wonderful, truly wonderful. Oh, it's wonderful to be presenting the film in Dublin because we did so much of the work on the film in Dublin. And we have our great lead actress who is from Dublin, so it feels all very right. Oh, well, it's essential to be, have a festival screening because otherwise how do you get the word of mouth out, you know? And uh, for, for an independent film, you absolutely need the audience and the way you start with the audience is a festival. And it's, you know, it's wonderful because everybody comes because they love movies. It's, it's very light, it's delightful, it's also, it's got a dark edge, which I like, and it all takes place in one house, which is very convenient for low-budget filmmaking. Well, you know, I, um, this is my first time really doing the festival circuit, and it's been extraordinary because you get a response that you just don't get otherwise. The cast and everybody get to see up close how people and critics feel about it. It's, um, it's been terrific.